good morning guys today is thursday and i'm starting the weekend vlog today just because yesterday was ash wednesday so i was at church um but my ashes came off when i was sleeping but anyway yesterday was ash wednesday um so i'm very much like feeling uplifted very much in the lenten spirit so got things that i want to work on this lent um things that i want to better about myself aspects of my life that need reform that need just more attention i think in general so one of those things very much so is how i interact or relate to i think interact with my friends um even george was saying it to me last night but i'm not really the type of person who goes out or who who checks on my friends as much as i should like i'll probably text my friends here and there and then other than that i'll be like i'll reply to statuses or stuff like that on instagram but like personally one-on-one -on -one checking on my friends like calling or texting or just being like are you okay what's going on i'm not really a type of person do, who does that and i think lately i've been so consumed in my own issues that i feel like i don't have the time or or you know the mental capacity to deal with other people's issues but i know that like if i need people then definitely my friends need people too you know what i'm saying so so i want to very much become a more present friend um yeah i definitely want to become a more present friend so during this lent i'm making way more of a conscious effort to check on my loved ones check on my friends check on the people i care about make sure they're good and if they're not try to be there for them as much as i can you know with everything i also have going on at the same time but i forgot to say hi my name is kula but you can call me potato mommy and if you're an old subscriber thank you for coming back and if you're a new viewer and this is the first time seeing me on your screen please be sure to subscribe i make family and lifestyle related youtube content um so yeah like i was saying today is a thursday um i really don't have much to do today but later on in the day um i'm going out to hang out with tinashe like in the evening um it'll be me george and tinashe so we're just gonna have like a chill little night you know spend some time together because i haven't seen sis tina in a while i mean i see her but like i haven't like properly like hung out interacted you know found out what's going on with her in a while so definitely a need there's construction going on by next door so if you can hear like the noise the shaking sound and everything it's because they're digging up the ground putting in foundations because they're made, building clusters by next door so that's yeah we're just gonna have to deal because i figured if i try and wait for the lease to stop it's not gonna stop they're gonna be building for a while so it is what it is anyway right now i'm planning on making breakfast and then we'll see where the day takes us i think we have a meeting later with one of the clients what is this is this baby powder so my i think we'll be going out with that but other than that i think we'll just see where the day takes us this room is desperately in need of a clean so i think after breakfast i'm gonna come and clean the room up this is my breakfast very basic i've got some buns avocado and some eggs avocado slander will not be tolerated on this channel and then my tea right now i've got a cup with hot water and milk and sugar i just need to add my tea and this is the tea i've been drinking lately it's the it's a chai flavored tea blend it's really nice it's got like a hint of like spiciness but like very very mild really good though you don't even know me like that are you best for time? Put you on my mind. Come a little closer like that. Staying up all night. Throwing drinks back. Blue eyes smiling while you're cursing. I admit it's working. You're working. Don't care, you're crazy is perfect. Shaky and I'm slurring Cause I'm nervous 
Okay, so we just got back from our client meeting um actually it turns out it was with anis the dentist you guys if you're on instagram you know who anis the dentist is anyway um we had a really good meeting like really good like he was really happy and also he ended up giving us these as a little gift when we were leaving these are he's got his own brand of like tooth care products dental care products so it's called the Good Smile Company. Can you see that? And then it just says smile. And they are bamboo um, toothbrushes. It says they're eco-friendly soft toothbrushes. So this is what the toothbrush looks like. What is this powder that keeps getting on me? I think there's baby powder on this thing. Okay. Anyway, this is what the toothbrush looks like is the good small co right here it's a toothbrush very soft bristles very pretty so it's one for each of us so now we've got matching toothbrushes but because we just replaced our like toothbrushes i think i think we replaced our toothbrushes when last week right so i'm not going to use these what we decided actually was because we got them from a client and they're really pretty we're going to keep these as like our travel toothbrushes so whenever we are going somewhere like to travel and stuff these are the toothbrushes we're going to be using but yeah and then after that we went to hostels because um for tanaka who is the guy who hurts the cows kufa and his pair of boots that he had got like ruined by water and cut by water so it hurt him like it's been hurting him over time like really really badly to the point where now he just had like a problem the last time we went we saw him limping so then we asked him we're like oh well that's quite a or something that's when he told us because we didn't know this whole time so then um that was on sunday no that was on monday that was on monday so we went to buy him gumboots at hostels and since we're in hostels i got these as well because jesse needs new crayons one thing is if you have a toddler you are buying crayons at least every two weeks it's just one of those you will try your hardest to like make sure they're like put in the right place and this and that but they're always breaking one is getting lost just so i'm hoping getting him twisters will work at school they use twisters so whenever i buy him school stuff i buy him twisters but for home i just used to buy him the normal crayons but they keep getting broken and lost and stuff so i'm hoping maybe if it's twisters i had to get that easily hoping but anyway these were um almost five bucks these were expensive let me not lie to you but the gum boots were like seven dollars so in total it was like it was like 13 bucks but then because we have the holsteads discount card it ended up being eleven dollars ninety five cents so i just got them because oh well um but yeah i'm gonna chill now mm. let me show you guys actually my little outfit first i am getting a tripod soon i promise and when i do you guys are gonna suffer with content because wow but anyway this is my little outfit i think i'll get like a picture and probably put it here but this whole thing head to toe is mr price this t-shirt it's actually like up to here but i tucked it in and i tied it at the back no oh, it's coming undone but like i tied it at the back like a little so it would be like a little crop top and then this dress um this was my christmas dress that i got from my husband from mr price in botswana last year together with, and this t-shirt also is from mr price and then these shoes these loafers whole fit is mr price but i feel very cute and i think when we go out tonight i'm gonna change the shoes and wear these orange like little block heels just to like dress it up so it's like you know it's 
life change, but we'll take it from like daytime to nighttime with the heels. But yeah, I'm gonna chill now. Um, I think I'm gonna try and help my husband with some work and then, well, I'm gonna make lunch. Actually, let me make lunch because we both haven't eaten. I'm gonna make lunch, help him with some work and then get ready for our little wine date. I've just finished eating and I realized I didn't even show you guys what I cooked, but I made um, cabbage fried rice. I was really hungry, so I didn't even think of taking out my phone to film or to show you guys. I scarfed that down so quickly. But George has gone to the office, so I gave him his food to go. George went to the office, so I'm basically by myself now, waiting for Jesse to come back. Apparently, there's a cyclone that's just hit. I don't remember where it's hit, but now it's um, bringing like rains to Mozambique and Zim. And like right now, it's raining but not a lot but they're saying that tomorrow is going to be like pretty bad like the rain <clears throat> so jesse's school canceled school for tomorrow um they also didn't have school on monday and tuesday because monday was still exit weekend and tuesday was national youth day so they've only gone to school wednesday and thursday this week tomorrow he's not going um but you know such as the life he's only in like ECDB so it's not that big of a deal missing school like that then um oh yeah also because of the weather and stuff we cancelled our um wine night and we moved it to Saturday and I'm hoping that Saturday um we're gonna take Jesse to my in-laws house for Saturday into Sunday that way I can do what I want to do on Saturday without having to worry about a babysitter because i want to go for the youtubers meetup george and i want to go for the youtubers meetup um first like i don't know what time it's starting actually i haven't asked but yeah i want to go to the youtubers meetup and then also after that you want to go for a little outing type thing with tinashe so basically that's the update I'm not going to do much else today. I want to spend the rest of my day chilled. I'm about to take these clothes off. Wear something super, super comfortable, super warm. Get into my blankets and just chill. Watch some Netflix, you know. I've been tying my hair like this since, like, yesterday. Only because, like, my hair is still super short. So it comes out of the braid, like, really quickly. And now it's really showing. So I've been like tying it up to try and like cover it a bit. But I feel like it really is cute. Like it frames my face quite nicely. So I'm going to be wearing it out like this maybe for the next, like for a week, two weeks. Hopefully I can do another two weeks with these braids and then take them out. And then we'll figure out what we're going to do from there. But Amy didn't decide to watch on her phone. Yeah, I know Amy doesn't want to watch on her phone. Why? I don't know. She wants to watch on the TV like you too. Why? I don't know. Go and watch together. When she's done with her show, then you watch your own show. You're taking turns. And we're one. And we're back one. Yeah. So for now, I'll go on now. And huh? Mm -hmm. yeah. You're making sock puppets? Yeah. Come show me. Puppets. Ah. Uh, look here. What happened? Don't put the sock in your mouth. It's okay. It's just a little bruise. So it'll go away. Doggy Is it bleeding? No, it's not. No, it's not. No blood. Doggy have a uh, She's not at the moment. Oh, I can see. Jesse, it's oh, not even visible. Go show Mama Taddy your soft puppets. Go show Dada, Mama Taddy, and Amy, everybody. Okay? Yeah. Everybody mm -hmm. Good morning, guys. Today is Friday um indoor friday jesse didn't go to school because his whole school had to close down because of the whole cyclone warning situation going on but it is a very sunny well can't see see very sunny friday so i don't know if it's gonna rain but like you never know like it could just the weather could just change all of a sudden but i just want to do laundry because so i did it and i need to clean this room and fold another load of laundry that i did before so i'm pretty much just gonna spend my friday indoors doing like house stuff 
pretty much um it's gonna be very boring so i don't know if i'm gonna vlog today tomorrow is when we've decided to shift our little like um dinner situation with tina so i'm excited about that because it means i actually have plans on saturday because the youtubers meetup was apparently cancelled i only found out this yesterday in my mind i was still like we're going good thing i found out in time because otherwise i was genuinely going to be there tomorrow like where's everybody at but i guess it's better finding out late than never so now that that's cancelled i have nothing else to do so i'm excited i at least have plans with sestina we're probably gonna go to the farm as usual and then see where the rest of the weekend takes us i'm about to take a shower and look like a decent human being i'm gonna use this body scrub today i don't know if i showed you guys this when i got it but i got this um from my sister and it's a coffee scrub so ever since i had jesse i've been using coffee scrub scrubs to help like lighten my stretch marks because i got really 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 dark very visible stretch marks but it helped them to be like not as dark they're still there obviously but then they're not like black anymore but now that i was pregnant again they've kind of come back and my tummy is still like very much um suffering from hyperpigmentation it's not as black as it used to be maybe like a month or so ago but it still is like pretty dark so we're back on coffee scrubs so i'm gonna take a shower and i'm using this today um first i need to get these out of the so we went home like this midweek just to go like water the plants and stuff but then we realized these three were like suffering so joy decided to bring them back here we yeah, we came back with these, but these two have recovered like significantly. They're flourishing. This one has recovered, but like a few of the leaves are pretty damaged, but I think it's gonna be okay. I've been forgetting to vlog all day today, but Tinashe told me specifically that I have to vlog and create content apparently. So, hi guys, today's Saturday. I haven't vlogged the entire day, but we haven't done much anyway. Whoa. Jesse is at my in-laws house. Um, for the night so we are baby free tonight which means i can be a hot mom and not have to worry about dealing with a child when i get home but we are at highland park we're going to the new pariah it's called upstate tinashe is taking us on a friend date so yeah i'm just gonna take you guys through the day with us the night actually and yeah i'm talking really fast because we are late as usual as per but we've made it and that's the important thing we're supposed to be here at six i'm pretty sure it's half six now and i'm sure tinashe is going to be upset because tinashe is one of those people who's always on time annoyingly this is my hot husband he's acting like he can't tell i'm filming okay 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 but yeah he's a cutie he looks so pretty you want to say hi no yeah we know no no at some point he really doesn't have a choice he just i don't know so not even going to say okay okay so one two three oh. why do you do this to us <laughs> is this the don julio yeah you said it's supposed to go down smoother. It's warm. It needs to be cold. <laughs> Auntie, I've never trusted you again. It's warm. What you do you want to say again? Because you're going to, gonna gonna to deal with me at the end of the night. This is my plate. I have a plate of sides because I'm not eating meat. I don't know. And then this is Tinashe's plate. No, next time don't invite me. Because why are people eating like this? Tinashe and I hey, were on this same vegetarian journey. No, of course, but I'm you're eating. And then this. Then what? <laughs> you have a full chicken on your plate. You're supposed to support me. We're married. <laughs> Both of you. 
You're married to me too. Ain't no love in the streets. So what is this? Ain't no love in the streets, babe. My husband and my church wife. Welcome to my content today. Oh. Good morning, guys. Today is Sunday. I didn't go to church. I still got eyeliner and mascara on. I want to spend my Sunday in bed. I was supposed to upload this vlog today because I'm trying to upload on Sundays and Wednesdays. I don't know if that's going to happen because who is editing it like this? But if I do manage to edit it, then you'll be seeing this vlog today, literally. If not, then it is what it is. I mean, if I'm done before one o'clock, I can still upload it, right? Also, I broke my nail. So, the ghetto. But anyway, for me, Potato Mommy, this is the end of the vlog. Um, I don't have the energy to keep vlogging. And I don't think we're doing anything today. We're probably just going to go out later to get Jesse. But that's it. I'm sending you guys love and light. Say bye. Bye.